Hi there everyone, I'm News A Meteorologist Ashley Baylor with a check of your latest forecast. Hopefully you're having a great Wednesday so far. We're making our way through the week here. The past couple of days have been rather windy, certainly not as windy out there today, but we have been watching the clouds come in. Good news is as we go through this afternoon, we will stay dry despite that cloud cover. Now even though it's not going to be nearly as windy, things did cool down. Temperatures will only be in the upper 40s this afternoon, although hard to complain about that considering that is seasonal for this time of year. But certainly some changes on the way for Thursday, a winter weather advisory will go in effect for northern Litchfield County from tonight right through Thursday morning, and let's show you why. Here's our hour by hour forecast where for the rest of this afternoon we'll have the clouds, but no rain showers in sight. But we will start to see some showers developing later on this evening. Then as we get past midnight, some steadier rain will move in. But look up in the northwest corner where we have that winter weather advisory. That's where we actually could see temperatures drop enough that we see the switch from rain over to sleet and freezing rain. So there certainly could be issues north of Litchfield, say up towards Salisbury, Colebrook, Norfolk, places like that. Possibly, uh, you know, even sneaking into northern parts of Hartford County. That'll continue to be the case as we go right into Thursday morning. And you'll notice for the most part the rain will be light, but at times we could have bouts to moderate to heavy rainfall. And unfortunately, Thursday is looking rather soggy. Now, in addition to the wet weather, the winds are going to pick up a little bit overnight, gusting between 25 to 35 miles per hour. So nothing to write home about there. But uh, if you're a light sleeper, the combination of the rain and wind may keep you up. So tonight, rain developing, becoming steady after midnight. That sleet and freezing rain up in the north west corner and then tomorrow is looking like a soggy day with temperatures only in the low to mid 40s. So here's a look at your eight day shoreline forecast where things will dry out and warm up on Friday. Highs near 60 degrees as we close out the week. As we look ahead to this weekend, we are looking mostly dry for Saturday and Sunday, although I can't rule out a late day shower on Saturday. There could even be a late day shower or flurry for inland areas on Sunday. But again, nothing major, nothing worth canceling any outdoor plans. Unseasonably cold on Monday highs only in the mid to upper 30s.